So we're out mowing, first day mowing, and uh, we've already done one, two, three. This is our fourth one. Um, the first three, Billy mowed two of them with the Walker B, and I had to push mow the other one. But this is the first one I got to use the Toro on. You guys have seen this big property before. And uh, I used the Toro on the whole front over there, all down that side, all down the other side of the building, and all up that side over there. And uh, that thing did great. But here's uh, old Billy laying down his first stripes of the season on the Walker B. I've been flying from town to town, from London to Taiwan. I've been all around the globe trying to protect your soul. We literally filled up two of that black bin right there. We filled up both of those with all the garbage we picked up out of here. And then the whole front area, I filled up my big bagger. That's a big trash bag on this Toro. I filled that thing up twice. Um, and then it's still partly full again for the third time. But here's old Billy mowing along. doing his thing usually we do the first cut at about three and a quarter and that's where we've been for uh for these properties here i think we did one or two of them at three inches but uh three and a quarter they put over the window they put a snow fence up that runs straight down the center here so that wind doesn't blow across from either way the wind usually goes that way and it doesn't drift over these roads so this year when they went and took it down they drove a truck right through the center here so it made it really bumpy but what's Billy doing there? All picking up more trash. We found liquor bottles, all kinds of stuff in here. We do every year. There's a couple of tiny little pieces we can't really get, but this here actually doesn't belong to this company that pays me to mow all of this and all around the building. This part here actually belongs to the gas line and the city is the one that puts the fence up.
So we're back at the house. A couple of great things say. We had, this thing was just going insanely slow. Way too slow for me, but I found out there's controls right here. You move those two, these are like, it's like a spring. You move those back and this keeps these bolts from, or these nuts from turning. You pop that off and then it tells you, you turn it, you turn them both that way to make it faster. You know, like uh, counterclockwise to make it faster and clockwise to make it go slower. So I cranked them a bunch of turns and I just drove it around the driveway and it's flying. I do have one issue though, I don't know if you guys can see it, but right under there, I have a hydro line leaking. And the way that it's turned, it's bent off. So it looks like it's almost collapsing that line. So I'm gonna fix that, no big deal, but I have to, uh, I have to, um, wait for this thing to cool down because it's hot but the other good thing is is i started using yard book a lot more this year than um i used to use a lot years ago but i started using it a lot more this year and it's awesome because i have each one of my routes right on yard book app on my phone so when i get done with each lawn all i gotta do is hit set is completed and it marks it down then at the end of every month all i do is go to that customer and it has them already dates and times right there and i just hit send to send them an invoice or print to print one out so super excited about that i don't have to keep carrying that clipboard around like i've done in years past so day one done and mowing billy I have a question what i have all all the time I've hurry seen up this, this battery's trailer. dying okay all the time i've seen this tra this trailer i was just sitting there and i'm looking around what the heck does that light switch go to it goes to the light that's up there. There's, really There's a light switch on the wall over there. It goes that light up there. It's not going to work because you have to have 12 volt power from the um, truck going to the trailer plug where it plugs in. And for some reason, there isn't 12 volt power on the truck, and I just never added it. So, anyway, that's the end of our day. Tomorrow's another full day of mowing, and I'm excited. I'm super happy to be back out. And uh, Billy's plowing through sunflower seeds like crazy. Somebody, when they just sent us hand sanitizer, they sent us a couple more packs of taco seeds, but those didn't last long. So we need to get more taco seeds. We need to get a bunch more seeds. We just went and, a full uh, bag today. Yeah, we went through a full bag of taco ones today and half a bag of the dill pickle ones. These so. guys are dill pickle. We need to get more seeds. Anyway, we're closing this out right here, guys. Um, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And, no, no. Oh, subscribity bobbity button. Whatever. Scribibby bobby Scribibby button. Scribibby bobby button. But anyway, if you guys remember from that video, he's got me saying that now. I'm supposed to say it. But anyway, um, usually my upload time is 5.30 every day. So it's been all winter. That's going to change now. Um, my new upload time every day, all my videos will be set for 6.30 um and that's what time they'll come out every day just because it, it's spring we're working a lot now and i'm not always going to get home and have time to edit them before then so anyway that's it we'll see you